Do you know how to host your Next.js web application on Vercel at free of cost? In this video, I will walk you through the step-by-step -step process to host your Next.js app on Vercel, which is not only free but also optimize your Next.js project. First, understand what Vercel is. Vercel is a platform created by the same team behind Next.js and uses the most powerful cloud architecture AWS. It offers features like serverless function, automatic scaling, and super fast deployment. Plus, it's incredibly developer friendly. Before hosting on Vercel, you must push your code on any Git based source code repositories like GitHub, Bitbucket, or GitLab. Don't worry, these are free and keep your code secure. In previous videos, I already created a Next.js travel guide website template. If you haven't watched it yet, please check the description box. I already post my source code in this GitHub repository. Though this is a public repository, you don't need to make your source code public. Now open Vercel.com and log in with your GitHub account. Then click on the next project button on the dashboard. Vercel will ask for access to your GitHub, GitLab or Bitbucket account. Here adding my GitHub account. and add the project repository. In the next day, Vercel will automatically detect that it is a Next.js project and configure everything for you. Next, click on the deploy button and that's it. Within few seconds, your app will be live and you will get a public URL. Now deployment is completed. And here is the live URL. Now you can make changes on your code locally and push them on your GitHub repository. And Vercel will automatically redeploy your app with the latest changes. Before wrap up, here is some bonus tips. You can easily add a custom domain to your app from the Vercel dashboard. Also manage environment variables securely for your app. Vercel also offer built-in analytics to track your app performance. This feature make Vercel a complete and ori free hosting solution for modern web applications. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, hit the like button and subscribe for more. I will see you in the next video.